Here's my process for painting grout lines. The video is not going to be very good. I can't even find my little video tripod. Um, I kids like to play with it, but this is the gist. As I hold the phone with one hand, you paint the grout lines, and I would say don't even worry about getting it on the grout on the tile because it comes off very easily. You just don't want to do such a big section that the paint is completely dry. I would say no more than two or three minutes. And you can tell I'm not just painting, but I'm really rubbing the paint into the grout lines because the paint doesn't sit on top. According to the manufa manufacturer, it penetrates the grout. It also acts as a sealer, so I will not have to seal these grout lines after I paint them because this is a new grout. I mean, it's honestly, it's a couple months old now, and this is just the last little bit of section that I haven't painted. I think the two nights of doing the rest of the floor made me crazy. and Or maybe it was I wanted to save a section in video. So you can see I'm not worrying about getting it on the tile again. Do a very good job over here. I will use two hands, or maybe not, right up against the wood. I'm not sure how well it will wipe off, it would wipe off a hardwood. But okay. So there it is, all painted, and this is an old tank top. Ta-da! It wipes right off. Now you just have to repeat that process like 500 times to finish your tile floor, but it's not that bad. I watched Netflix on my iPad for hours and hours and hours, but then it was done. And I didn't have to come in here every day and think, oh, that crowd is really, really bothering me. I mean, some people just don't care and that's great, but yeah. It would have bothered me forever. So I'm sure you're already bored watching this. That's pretty much it. If after you wipe it off, you notice that you didn't rub it in very well to a certain spot, then just go back and touch it up. See, like right here and here, but I figure then you know more instantly than waiting around for to dry. And with my rub off method, you can pretty much use it right away. Like walk on, I mean, you're not going to clean the grout lines right away, but you can certainly walk on the tile and it's not going to hurt the grout at all. The painted grout, I should So this was my solution for grout that I really hated. I bought the grout at the tile shop and it was supposed to be a dark color and either she entered it wrong or misunderstood me or they gave me the wrong, I don't know where the problem happened, but I definitely wanted a darker grout just for ease of keeping it clean. You know, it always ends up looking dark gray anyway. So what I used to paint it was this um, Poly Blend Grout Renewal. I got it at Home Depot. This color is natural gray. And when I tile my shower, I will just go ahead and buy the Poly Blend Grout in natural gray so I won't have to paint it. Cause that would be silly. And there you have it. The rest of the floor was painted a while ago. Um, there's some dirty parts because I'm still working on the construction, so there's some like dust everywhere. Alright, well thanks for watching.